welcome to English Tips with Eddie. All you ever wanted to know about learning English and more. Today, ways of saying good and bad. Okay, from the top of your head, how many ways of saying good or bad can you list? Okay, sure, context is vital. I agree. I'm pretty confident, though, that you could do better than some famous politicians. Let's have a look at some. Good. We can say a pleasant surprise. Fine wine. A virtuous person, a competent manager, a skilled worker, useful advice, a reliable source. Instead of good, we can say a kind gesture, a generous donation, an authentic painting, excellent support, a favorable outcome. A great team, or a prime example. We can also say a marvelous opportunity, a real pleasure, well behaved children, or an acceptable excuse. <laughs> what about bad? Yeah, what about bad? Instead of bad, we can say a substandard house, an ineffectual plan, an imperfect solution, a second-rate restaurant, an appalling accident. We can also say inferior quality, a useless tool, a defective machine, shoddy workmanship and terrible weather. No excuses now. You can use all of them. Have fun impressing your friends and um, famous politicians as well. For more information about the use of good and bad as well as some more adjectives, please check the links in the description below. Thank you for watching and see you again soon. Don't forget to subscribe, like it and leave your comments below. Bye!